Kids Fest is a combination of uh, main stage, live performance venues, and interactive activities. It's about giving families the opportunity to make collective memories together, have a shared experience, laughing, singing along, clapping along. It's also about exposing kids to the arts at a young age. I love playing the festival because just because it's the contact with the with this audience, with the the vulnerable child. I mean, I, I've made a career out of performing for for families, for children, you know, um, across the country, uh, around the world, for that matter. And and the value of music in the life of the child has always been critical from my point of view. And this festival has a different feeling than any other festival uh, that, that I've been to. There's an energy about it that, that really really does link with the with the child and the parent and the grandparent. I've noticed something here at the Kids Fest in Winnipeg is that they're they're not afraid to expose the kids to a bunch of variety of stuff. From of course Fred Penners who are absolutely amazing and, and then there's stuff like us, Le Group Swing, who we come out with a DJ who does some break dancing and we mix traditional French folk with urban hip hop, which is probably not what you normally see at a kids fest. But the fact that the kids get all these different experiences, it's clear that they come out of this festival with so much more knowledge and so much more experience. One of the things that we added at Kids Fest uh, about three or four years ago was a venue, it's called uh, Artists and Audiences Bridging the Gap, where families can go see a main stage performance, or kids with their school group or daycare group, and then they can go to the workshop area, and they can actually get their hands on the instruments, or they can you know, see how the, the whole songs are created, they can learn how, you know, hoop dancing, they can watch the hoop dancing performance, and then go try it, which is, I like the tactile element of that, because it really breaks the barrier down between a semi-passive experience between something that's really hands-on. I think it's a part of, they're actually learning without realizing it, <laughs> and uh, in different ways and in creative ways. Now there are my friends I met in the park. We're from Vancouver and we do a lot of performing on the West Coast and sort of working our way across the country. This is our first time here at the Winnipeg International Children's Festival. It's got a, a different concept. There's no um, ticketed performances for the concerts. People can kind of come and go and, and try a little bit of this and a little bit of that. So it seems really nice. Here in Manitoba, you have really the uh, maybe the richest sort of heritage of children's entertainers between Fred Penner, and of course Al Simmons, both of, of whom are, are here at this festival. Manitoba is a great place for children's music. 